Hello, Rayquazers. So, basically, got a special battle for you here. It's an Ubers match, but you'll see that this background's not the normal background. With some green screening and stuff, and that green screen background that is there. And, uh, of course, the uh, battle backgrounds, if you've gotten that, then you can make custom backgrounds. The only bad thing is everything else that, like, has green in it also gets, like, transformed into the background, so that's the bad thing. But it still looks really, really cool. And also, Straddle Artica 9000 will not do an RU match. And I told him I'd get the Ray Quasars on him. So everyone, go to the video in the link and beg him to do an RU match. Okay? Get ready to do it. Go. Okay. So basically, I'm facing Ilya. This is kind of, you know, revenge for when he beat me in Calm Storm because I had a crappy team. And see, you can see that's messing with Ferrothorn a little bit. And I'm going to rain in Palkia, because I figured obvious v create is obvious, and Palkia could take it the best. But he goes for the U-turn, which is not a bad move, because that gets him out of there. And then he's going to bring in Lugia, an obvious Toxic, or Dragon Tail is obvious, so I figured, you know, might as well go ahead and go into Ferrothorn. I'm going to go for the Stealth Rocks, since I went first, that means he's going for a phasing move. He turns out to be carrying the Dragon Tail, which is a little bit strange, because Whirlwind is overall better, because it breaks through subs, and... He wouldn't have taken the Ferrothorn damage. So, that's his mistake. So, he's going to withdraw here and go into Rayquaza, which kind of looks different, because, you know, that whole green screening thing again. Kind of makes for a cool Cosmic Cra Cosmic Quaza, though. And Cosmic Ferrothorn. Let's just call him the Cot. So, ev every time I use a space background, we'll just call anything that has green in it Cosmic from now on. Hope that's okay. It, I'm doing it anyway, so it doesn't matter. So he's going to go for the Dragon Dance, and I bring in Palkia, because I'm faking a Scarf. I'm actually running a Haban Berry, but I'm faking a Scarf, and he tends to, he actually falls for it, because he wastes his extreme speed, as I go for a Spatial Wind. And then he's going to bring in Salamance, which I'm not sure, like, if he was trying to bait me into anything or something, because that was weird. I, I'm not really sure on that. But he's going to switch into Zekrom, maybe thinking he needs Death Fodder and Zekrom's best. And so, he might have, he might still be thinking I'm Scarfed at this point, which is not the case, of course. But, you know, I can always scare him like that. So he's going to bring in Victini, you know, and Victini will probably be faster, even if I am Scarfed, but I'm not Scarfed, so it doesn't matter. And as you can see, the uh, battle background is also messing with blue a little bit. So that's highly disappointing. He's going to bring in Palkia, and I figured my best bet for this Palkia is Ferrothorn. Even if he had a Fire Blast, the rain would weaken it, so I'd be able to take at least one. So I go for the Leech Seed. Fortunately, he doesn't have the Fire Blast, and he has the Ori Spear. That did a lot of damage, though, so I'm thinking he might be a choice spec set. Um, kind of guessing on this. He is going to switch out, maybe thinking I'll switch out, or he just doesn't want me getting health back from Leech Seed. And I'm going to go for the Protect. And I went for the Protect here to see what he'd go for, but I didn't pay attention when he actually went for his move. So I didn't know what he went for. And so I was like, well, uh, if he went for Recreate, I should probably get out of here. But he goes for U-Turn instead, which is, yeah, not bad, not bad, you know. Um, Giratina manages to take it pretty nicely. And so Salamence is going to come in again and, out and just straight up go for the Outrage, which is... Weird, considering I still have Ferrothorn. Um, not really sure why he went for the Outrage on that one. So that's very, very strange. Because now I can just spin in Ferrothorn, take a hit from this Outrage, dish him out some Iron Barb's damage, in addition to his Life Orb damage, and get off a of Leech Seed, which is going to help me heal up a little bit. And so right here, I, drain, I get some health back with Leech Seed and Leftovers, puts me back at 200, which is respectable. And I'm going to go for the Protect. He decides to go for the Fire Blast. He actually breaks through the Confusion. But I have the Protect, so he misses. Salamence goes down. Down. Fall. Fall into the atmosphere. And so, yeah, Victini's going to show up. And uh, I'm going to try and double Protect to see what he's going to go for. But I fail. He goes for the V-Create, which is actually going to end up damaging him a little bit. And this is the opportunity I was waiting for. Because guess what? Extreme Killer Arceus, since Rain is up, I know I can easily take a V-Create. Because, uh, you know, even if it was Choice Bandit, I'd still live it. 
I just wouldn't live it as much, but obviously Choice Grove, because looking at the damage, that seems to be a Choice Grove range. And so I'm going to go for the Shadow Claw, knowing that he's going to be slower, and why waste an extreme speed if I don't have to, especially since I may need him a little bit later on in the battle. So I'm going to go for the extreme speed on the Palkia, which Oko's it. Oh yeah. Way to go, Arceus. And I, I'm a little bit surprised at this. So I go for the Shadow Claw. I thought Lugia might survive with a little bit. Nope. Straight up Oko. So that's going to be the battle. So hope you guys really enjoyed it. And hope you guys enjoyed the backgrounds. Don't expect them every battle because of the whole green effect weird thing. And as I said, go check out Strato Artica 9000's video. Tell him he better get an RU or else Rayquazers are just going to gain up on him and beat him into the ground until he puts an RU. Not really, but seriously, go big for an RU. See you guys later.